Retired civil servants in Taraba State may soon have cause to smile following the state government's special intervention of 4.7 billion naira earmarked for pensions and gratuities in the 2022 budget. Speaking at the 2022 budget breakdown in Jalingo, the Commissioner for Budget and Planning, Solomon Elisha, said the budget is expected to commence this month in compliance with the yearly cycle and also an opening balance of 350 million naira. Olabi Adenusi filed this report. The Ishakos administration is battling hard to address the inherited gratuities and pensions of over 5,000 pensioners in Taraba State. When the administration came on board in 2015, the unpaid gratuities and pensions had accumulated to billions of naira. The situation was so pathetic that the pensioners could not meet up with their daily needs, coupled with the face of economic hardship the country was undergoing. Governor Darius Ishaku has made of setting the backlog of arrears and gratuities of pensioners one of his priorities. Before the COVID-19 outbreak, the administration had introduced a system to reduce the pensioners' gratuities every three months. The move was generally applauded. The budget is well guided by microeconomic assumptions as projected by the federal government of Nigeria in conjunction with NGF, Taraba State Pension Board, four billion seven hundred and twenty-eight million seven hundred and seventy-two thousand five hundred and nineteen naira zero kobo. Pensioners interviewed by TVC News shared divergent views on whether translating the budget figure to real form can be achieved. They lament that many of their retired colleagues before now are yet to be captured in the gratuity list. We have just we have just been hinted that the government is going to take care of the of the payment. And in fact, I retired since 2013. And there is no sign of government paying our gratuity. So presently a lot of our colleagues are dying. They are dying. They are not only that, most of them are crippled now. In fact, they are vulnerable. So we are, we are crying to the government very urgently. Government should come to our aid to alleviate our sufferings. Last year, 2020, 21, they said there was a budget for retirees. That year came and finished, nothing was given to us. So we don't even have the hope that the government is going to do anything. In the 2022 budget breakdown, the state is expected to spend 78.7 billion naira on recurrent expenditure, and capital expenditure is projected to take 71.71 billion naira, while 83.2 billion naira is also budgeted for the state library board. In the budget, the office of the accountant general received the lion's share of 16.1 billion naira for debt servicing and consultancies, followed by the Office of the Governor with 11.3 billion naira. The State Sports Council got the least allocation of 31 million naira.